It is harvest season for area farmers who find themselves in an ever-changing industry. For example, there are over 200,000 fewer farms in America than there were just 15 years ago. And that makes it a challenge to keep a farm in a family. And that makes the milestone for one family near Volga a truly cherished one. John Gaskins with their story tonight. For farmers all over the region, Saturday was a pretty typical day of harvest. But for Ethan Vanderwall, it provided a very powerful moment. One that you could say is for the ages. Well, I actually put Grandpa in the combine for he can run that. So I was in the grain cart with Cohen and Dad was hauling. Four generations in the field at the same time, with Cohen representing the sixth overall. It was like the aha moment, and we've been doing that on that piece of ground for 100 years. Lawrence's grandfather established the farm in 1923. Along with Ethan's uncle, Dean, these Vanderwalls all live within two miles of each other and work together almost every day. Well, Ethan's more the mechanic around here. Dean's more the cattle feeder. I'm more the agronomy guy. And Dad's, Dad's the fill-in guy. It's being part of the family, bringing some of the family members in the operation, and being able now at my age, I can step back and let them take over, but still be, have the opportunity to do what I can do yet. Oh, it's awesome. It's awesome. Yeah. To, have, to have me tell somebody that Dad's out at 7 in the morning feeding cattle when he's 79 years old. and yet he's his own boss. It may seem corny, but it's this kind of strong family bond that keeps the farm going and growing. The plot started at 160 acres and it's now 2,000 and business is strong with yields rising every year. There's new equipment challenges, new technology challenges, but it's all about how you approach a problem and how you uh, work with others. This includes the boss of the house who brings everyone together under one roof. Hi, this is mom calling to tell you guys the dinner's ready. And perhaps Cohen yes, will sir. have the run of the land in the future. That's the hope. I guess I'll do the best, do the best that I can yeah. and keep marching forward and uh, keep working and farming. And uh, if he wants to do the same, awesome. Near Volga, John Gaskins, Dakota News Now.